My L pilot. You know that guy you were seeing in the convenience store when you stopped off in a little town away to Grandma's house? Sort of shitty looking fella, buys a pack of smokes, a couple of lotto scratches, a tall boy at ten o'clock in the morning. The kind of guy you wait to come out before you and your family go in. Well, the guy, the guy's me. My name is L. You look, took the time to really know me, find out what kind of person I truly am, instead of just stereotyping me. Because of the way I look, well, you'll be wasting your time. Because I'm exactly who you think I am. Hell, I'm pretty much still anything that isn't nailed down. About six years ago, I started drinking when I got this, met this little firecracker. She got great booze, Peggy. Her name was not Peggy. Her name was Joy. She got great boobs, Joy. She kept buying me drinks. Later that night, she drove us to Vegas. And by the time I sobered up, we were married. Next morning, I was recuperating from being a little overserved. Morning, hubby. Hell, when I was drinking, I just thought she had a bit of a belly. Some people might think getting so drunk, you accidentally marry a woman. A six month pregnant is a good reason to stop drinking. Personally, I think it's a good reason to keep drinking. Joy didn't remember much about the boy's real father. Certainly drove a fool. So he named him Dodge. So, so a few days later, a few days later, we're having our first child from my own personal seed. The doctor's already told us he's going to come out a boy. So he once went ahead and named him what the, there he was. The old junior. People ask me how I just can stay and stay with a cheating wife and two horrible kids that ain't mine. I guess I just believe in century of marriage. Besides, I'm so just as many people ask her why she hasn't thrown out a good for nothing husband, a brother who lives on their couch, as Randy, the best brother anyone could ever ask for. He usually spend all days hanging out at El, El, El Ernie's crab shack. Hey, I got you, Earl. You got it? You got it. You have it. You're it. As Sony, you play beer can tag. Ain't no one who's funny, fool. I know where your mother parks your house. That's Darrell. He's always looking at us. The bowl's full of stuff he's not legally allowed. Put no cab crakes. Thanks, crab man. No problem, Earl. Hey, Doyle. Anytime, Joy. When I love the free crab meat. And for some reason, Joy loves coming here too. And if you were lucky, Wanda, Wanda would push B7. Oh no, she didn't. Wanda, didn't, don't tell me you pushed B7. Anyway, that was all life. Glamorous or nothing, but it's regular enough. At least it was regular enough. Until three weeks ago, son of a bitch, son of a bitch. Woohoo! Woohoo, I'm rich. One hundred thousand dollars, sucker. That was the happiest as soon as I was conscious. Then he went back to look for my scratcher. I knew he couldn't find it. I would have been more upset if I hadn't been so doped up. Hey, baby, hey there. Sign these next to the sticky little thing, yellow things. Okay, doggy, LJ. Hickory. Hey, crabman. Hey, yell. The real parents threw him out. Growing weed in his closet, so he's moving in. You're thinking, you're getting about getting married, but we are married. Not anymore, we're not. Thank you for the trailer. Trust me, Earl. It's going to be better for everyone involved. That Daniel Junior really should be with his daddy. Feel much better, okay, now. Okay. I ain't never been much of a complainer, but I'm lying fraction, traction that tonight, that night, knowing I no longer had a home, no longer had a wife. No longer the thousand, hundred thousand pound lottery trick it. Well, I think I might have cried. I was afraid of Randy waking up and seeing me. And it happened. I was just flipping the channels when he came on. Forget about me. I want to know about you. I want to know about Cole Dobbs daily. Every time I saw you, you were the most beautiful woman on your arm. You took a, you got a talk show. You got your own record company. What's your secret? Well, if you don't, I must know I'm Satan. I didn't know. Seriously, I've been very blessed. I always believe that what goes around comes around. That's how I try to live my life. 
You do good things, and good things happen to you. you do bad things, and they come back to haunt you. It's karma, karma. There it was, the secret of life. Could be straight over, straight from Carl Daly's lips to the morphine-laced ears, which they finally released me from the hospital. We checked into a motel. Didn't take them any long to make friends with the help. It never does. How long is your break, Cotillia? Cotillia? The manager went to the dog crack. I had got, I got my own schedule for the afternoon. Do good things and good things happen to you. Do fair things they come back to haunt you. As deep ill. Why don't you stop hugging the invalidins and give you, gave you, so we can all chat about what that for a while. I'm talking about karma. Who's karma? I don't know. Something Carlson Daly came up with. He said if he does good things in life, that's why his life is so great. Got me thinking, my life sucks. I ain't ever done anything good I could think of. Who's this Carlson Daly? Some sort of spiritual leader? Holy man, never seen T-R-L. You need to start putting on some of those TVs You've been, you've, when you're clearing the toilets. If you want a better life, I need to be a better person. What's this? I mean, a list of everything bad I've ever done. Why, Randy? Why? Why, Randy? I just won $100,000 in the lottery and was immediately hit by a car. I must die because something happened to me. I didn't deserve the karma stuff. Gonna kill me unless make up everything on the, up for everything on the list. Number friend ring peed in the back of a police cop car. No longer proud of that. Number thirty one. Is that your kid's Halloween candy when he came up to my trainer for trick or treat? That was wrong. I know that now. Number two hundred and two harmed and possibly killed innocent people with secondhand smoke. How the world are you going to make fix all those things out? I don't know. So the easy ones like uh, number sixty four. Pick on picked on Kenny James. I used to torment the hell of that poor boy back in elementary school. How do you think you're going to do? How do you think you're going to? What do you think you're going to do about that now? I don't know. Find him. Do something nice for him, and then cross it off the him off the list. Excuse me, but you. But if my boss goes back and sees there's no garbage. Parking, like he's gonna get used to it like that. So, could you please put it back? No, I can't. Number 103, 33. I've been a little bug. Well, here, cross it off the stupid list. I can't cross off the list. I until I picked up as much as I've lettered. And my list isn't stupid either. It's my road back to a better life. Well, I hope the road has good free gas, free food, and a van big enough for us to sleep. Because that just because we just spent our last $45 on my room, not cutting out my beer money for some stupid ass crade. Because they son of a bitch is working. When I went over to the lottery office, they made, made sure made a big fuss. Ran had an idea to get an extra 1,000, 100 a million, 1,000 out of the deal. Thank you, Isabella. Better. But I knew it wasn't going to work. Can I borrow a pen? When do you get started on my list as soon as possible? So my life could start getting better. Hell is already better. Our new friend Katina had a day off and nothing to do. So Randy and I had something pretty to look at. Plus, I finally had enough money to buy something I always wanted for my car, which at house belongs to the boy you talk to this boy you talked to. That his parents' house right over there. Don't know where can he still live, live where can he lives now, but Randy will find out now. I know. Whoa, whoa, that's four. I'm still thirsty. Look, what about, look, you had four. Should I have another one? You come out. Go on then. So why are you, why aren't you coming in? I was nervous when I lie. Randy's a pro, so long as he's got the right number of beers in him. Four seems to be the magic number. Any more, he starts to get a little unpredictable. Now your brother shaved the damn, shook. Now your brother shaved the damn cat again. Randy doesn't, Hasn't been inside Kenny's parents' house since he robbed it in high school. We all got a backpack full of, of, of birds. So we're visiting. So you're visiting all Kenny's classmates' parents. Only ones we lost contact with. You see, a class president is my duty to organise a reunion. Hate for anyone to miss out on the fun. You know what? You with all the catching up, 
with his little empty appetizers and all. Is that sweet? Can I have a beer, sir? Can I get a beer, you beer, son? I'd love a beer, thank you. Well, what are you doing? Don't don't you like me? Oh, no, you're nice. It's your, just Andy. Randy, you get, when you give... When did you give... When you came to give us the towels, he called dib, dibs. In case you're wondering why, how many beers it takes Randy to get himself in trouble. Nine seems to be the magic number. Lucky we got Kenny's address before he pissed off Mr. James. I think I have Kenny's yearbook in here somewhere. Dibs. At first we had a little trouble finding Kenny's house. See, Randy wrote the address on his hand. He spread it all off the last digit during his getaway. But eventually he found it. There it is, Kenny James, the man I've got a feeling, we're feeling with stomach. Maybe you've got stomach cancer. Got karma called stomach, can karma called stomach cancer? I don't know. It's probably just guilt. She was probably right. I wasn't proud of the way I treated Kenny. Hey, Kenny, I bet you strike out again, you dork. That's enough, girl. Just ignore him, Kenny, and try your best. You're out. I watched Kenny for a few days and tried to figure out how to make up for all the abuse I put him through. Kenny had a, good, had a good job and was a consistent manager. Copy hut. A blue power blue the car, which he took pride in, in the nicest house on the block. Didn't have anyone to share it with. He was lonely. There was something special missing in his life. Every man needs to have feel whole. Well, I mean, had get him laid. What, Kenny? I told him it bad. It made him feel bad his whole childhood. Can I cross him? I've got this. I've got to make him feel good. Little pigs would make up for all that plane. What kind of woman are you going to get to have sex with a scrawny little man like that? Yeah. You need muscles to get laid. Not with Patsy. Patty, you don't. Patty doesn't, isn't your run a meal possible, Richard? She was a good daytime hooker. Takes a special kind of get woman to sell toy favours. Like a day, I was right. Patty didn't care if a man had muscles. Muscles can buy, me, buy a mad dog. Her Patty. Her uh, boys, is one around his birthday today already? No, he's got another job for you. Hello, hello, my sweetie. For your green piece, I need to talk to you about the sky and wells and all that crap. Got anything to drink in here? Do you have a toothbrush I can borrow? Madam, look who's, well, look who's coming. Hey, you, you right? Hey, Joe, L, nice one. Hey, you guys, go looking to rob one of these houses, because... You'll unlock one down the street. No, thanks. All right. In fact, last time, I promise I'm not going to mess you up again. Where's Sonny? 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 I'm out of the house robbing business. Hey, hello, sweetie. Into the pimping business. Well, I can help you with that, too. I've got an uncle, real lonely guy. He gets a disability check every Thursday. Look, Sonny, we'll talk about it later. All right. How did he do? Go. Oh, he gave me $10 to help money be a monkey's. What, what about how was the sex? You got in, you got in something in the, anything in the tank left over me. We didn't do it. What, Paddy? We had a deal. I told you, I did what you said. I told him I thought he was cute. I tried to kiss him, but he was not interested. Damn it, Paddy. I'm on schedule here. Come on, Val. Paddy, I did it. Try it, Elm. I did it towards the end. I even pulled my, out my good boob. I think he's gonna remember you. Yeah, I, I think he remember me. remembers me. Can you calm down? A restraining order against you, Elm. Well, that was written on a brown paper bag by a school nurse 20 years ago. So I made you eat it, remember? Yeah, well, you take that, what you want and leave. All I want to do is talk. Hold on a second. If you've given yourself away, I'll take this. Put it down. You've got a CD playing in it. Put it down. Listen, Kenny. I'm here to help you. Don't need your help, buddy. You gave, you just gave it a chance for free sex. Dame, Dame Hooker. You need how I help, L. Not now, Randy. Shut that drawer around, Kenny. I'm here to help you find a woman so you can be happy. L, you think you're trying to sell a cat to a man who fancies dogs? I know that it might sound crazy in this day and age, but in a small town, I've never been face to face with gay before. I understood now that running probably wasn't necessary. That's it. K's off the list. Good. Isn't that, what, wasn't that the uh, against the rules? Look. I list this guy, mate, I made, it means I make the rules. Guy was gay, gay. That was special circumstances. Don't have to help this special circumstances here. Just give us a couple of cheeseburgers of the machine, okay? So what's new? 
Next, number 26, stole a car from a long-legged gal. What happened there? Oh, damn, gal. Have you lost your mind? Who's the whore? How, what did you just call me? She's the maid. Relax. Do you uh, think I'm going to find, wasn't going to find out? Damn. Look at that, my eyes are closed. I want half that lot of money, gal. I wanted a legit baby, a wife who didn't have paint on Thanksgiving. I guess life's full of little disappointments, aren't they? Ain't it? Anyone, there's only one mellow yellow left. You're going to wrestle for it. That's it. Give me that damn phone. I'm going to get the money out. I want it. That's, that's your ex-wife. Yep. As crazy as she is, I'd be lying if I said you're going to miss her. Hey, Carol. Hey, crap man. What happened? Karma. Karma happened. I believe it, and I believed it too.